Hello everybody and welcome back to an episode from JK with the AK. Guys, this is a lot different video than what I normally make. But uh, I'm doing it because this is a game which very, very interests me um, for the beta and for official release. So I've got a lot of stuff to tell you and information to show you in this video. First of all, I'm going to show you the official open beta launch trailer for Destiny 2. That is the first thing, so I'm gonna, just going to let that play. And uh, yeah, special thanks to um, one of the guys at Team JK headquarters, I'm going to call this. Um, for sending me some information and helping me make this video. So, uh, without further ado, let's watch this video. Let's get to it, Guardian. Hold on back there. Pre order and get open beta early access. Holy shit balls. Available on PC October the twenty fourth. And the PC beta will be August 2017. And the full game comes out September the 6th. Right. Let's get to basics. Um, I'll just read this. While you fight for very survival in free core activities, we'll monitor the technology that brings us all together. There'll be fun and games, but make no mistake, this is just a test. Your participation is a critical step on our road to launch. To date... Thousands of players have sampled the action in Destiny 2. We're about to expand that audience to include millions of brave beta testers. Now it's your turn to play. So what you should expect in the upcoming Destiny 2 beta. Homecoming, which is the opening mission and cinematics from Destiny 2's campaign. So you're going to get a little brief taster session for the first mission of the campaign, which is good. And I'm glad they're not doing any more or any less than that. Countdown, enter the Crucible, which was on the original Destiny, to battle other Guardians in a brand new game mode, attack or defend the base on a, uh, a new map, custom built to support this new game type. Awesome. Control, the original standard for Crucible combat is back with some impactful changes. Control the zones on another new map built with this objective in mind. Next up, the Inverted Spire. Sounds quite cool. Strike at the heart of a Vex stronghold. Bring two willing allies. So that's a, a free man team. Or look at that. Or let matchmaking introduce you to a fire team of guardians. So matchmaking to do with the inverted spy, which is awesome. New subclasses. The new fighting style for each class will be ready. Choose from the Dawnblade Warlock, the Arc Strider Hunter, or the Senatal Titan. The Farm. For one hour on Sunday, July the 23rd, we're inviting you to tour the new social space in Destiny 2. Starting at 10am Pacific, you're welcome to kick the ball into the net or befriend a chicken. Most vendors and services will be offline. Our goals are to see how many of you it can accommodate at once. So it's just a little test for their research. Here's some things which you guys should not expect in the upcoming beta of Destiny 2. Clan support. It's true that clans will be supported in Destiny 2, but those features are not part of this initial test. Which is understandable. They're not going to test at this point. But they will be coming out for full release. Character progression. You'll receive rewards for defeating your enemies, be they Cable, Vex, or other Guardians. But the beta does not represent how your characters will evolve in Destiny 2. Another quite obvious fact there. Character continuality. Destiny 2 is a fresh start. Nothing we do in the beta will carry over to the final version of the game on September the 6th. Of course, for every rule, there is an exception. So that is awesome. Um, and here's another bit of information. If you throw down with us in the Destiny 2 beta, the emblem will be waiting for you in September. This is our gesture of thanks for helping us get ready for launch. It will mark you as a volunteer member of the development team. They'll say, how can I get that? You'll say, had to be there. So that emblem is um, 
That, I believe. That, I believe. Um, which is cool. So a little exclusive if you pre-order the game and get the beta access. So this is a bit of information which you guys, I'm sure, click the video to find out. Destiny 2, pre-order and you get open beta early access. Now, this is the interesting thing. July the 18th to the 20th, which is a weekend, I believe, for PlayStation 4 early access beta. So you'll get the 18th, the 19th, and the 20th at 12 o'clock, I believe, to play um, Destiny first. PlayStation 4 this year, again, Destiny first for the beta test. And then the next day, so you'll have it for a day before Xbox One are on there, so they'll be playing the same weekend. And then July the 21st to 23rd will be a console open beta, so it's just open for PlayStation 4 and Xbox One just to play all at once. And then 2017... Unconfirmed date yet, you will have the August beta for the PC players. So, uh, yeah. The Red Legion come knocking on July the 21st. If you want to kick out the unwelcome map before then, pre-order to gain access a day or two early. This is your first dance with the new enemy. And if you're one of your... One of our new friends who refuses to play Destiny 2 anywhere but on your PC. We're still working to enlist you as a beta tester in late August. So that is all the information you need to know about the upcoming Destiny 2 betas. I'll be there. I'll pre-order the game. Destiny 1. Honest review. I played. I was addicted to it for a couple of months. Didn't play nothing else. And then I just thought it was a bit repetitive so I went off it. And I never went back to it again. But Destiny 2... They got a, this. That was a lot of problems with the previous fan base. They always said that it's a bit repetitive. So hopefully they've counteracted that. And I only ever upload videos of games I generally love. If they get views or not, I play them because I love them. And this is one of the games upcoming that I'm very, very interested in. So you'll be playing it officially September the 6th on PlayStation 4 and Xbox One, I believe. And it will be available October the 24th. For PC, so it's a month later on PC, which is very rare, and I'm glad they're doing it. They're giving them console players a reward for that release and exclusively, and you can play it first, like for a month before PC even get a sniff of it, which is fantastic. Right, guys, a little bit more information before I go. Some frequently asked questions about the Destiny 2 beta. Now, I know I find this helpful, so I'm hoping you guys can find it helpful as well. So, how do you get access to the Destiny 2 beta? <coughs> Excuse me. Pre-order Destiny 2 and you'll have early access to the upcoming betas prior to it becoming available in non-pre-ordering customers. So you will be able to play it um, before, even if you don't pre-order the game, but it will be available um, a few days earlier. So you only say, if you pre-order it just to get beta access, you're only having about two days exclusive. Is that worth it? Destiny 2 beta begins on the 7th, I've already said this, non Non pre ordering console players have access to the beginning of the uh, 1920. Yes, yeah, so you have three days if you pre order exclusive. Platforms it will be on is available on the PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. Um, beta testers will be available on all three. Um, I need a PlayStation Network Xbox Live account to access. Currently, yes. Um, yeah, so that's some frequently asked questions just to help you guys out if you have any questions. Any more questions, leave them down below in the comments and I'll be sure to answer as many as I know the answer to. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys. It's something a little bit out of my comfort zone, but I'm I'm doing a video on this because it's something I have a passion about and I want to play it. Um, Ark Ragnarok Let's Play will be coming when it drops on the Xbox One console. Anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like. It really helps out. Subscribe if you're new. Tell your friends about the channel. And, guys, comment down below if you have any questions. I'll answer as many as I can, as I say. And, yeah, have a good day, and I'll see you in the next one.